I'm at Lois E. Harp Park this morning, just south of Lakeland. I am looking for the Seven Wetlands Trail. And I plan to also utilize some of the mountain bike trails out here. There's a nice rugged area that I remember from a few years back when I was doing some trail running out here. But I don't want to get in their way and I've seen a couple of bikers out already. Um, so I'm very mindful that it's kind of their turf and um, I'm going to stay out of their way as much as I can. Let's see if I can find the trailhead. missing this kind of terrain so last week last week's hike was so different so open and so void of the the forest environment that this is really nice this morning and just a little trail etiquette here always oh, interesting to see what the uh, mountain bike clubs call their local trails Looks like I'm gonna find some elevation here. Nice. This is hands down some of my favorite terrain when it comes to hiking in Florida. Uh, it's just a trail that's lined with trees and um, gives this, this feeling of being in a green tunnel. Not a bad day. I mean, yeah, it's overcast and stuff, but it's not ugly. This is neat. Not too many bikers, but you gotta pay attention here because there isn't a whole lot of room if they were to come by to get out of their way. So 
be nice to each other on the trail. Guaranteed gator territory. Although with it being so overcast, it's really hard to see them. And I'm extremely sad of the amount of trash that is everywhere in this place. It's disgusting. I will actually pick up other people's trash while I'm hiking, but I'm not gonna jump in the water for it. All right, up we go. Pretty sure I'm gonna feel this tomorrow in my, at least in my weaker leg, since I have zero uh, <laughs> challenge. I've had zero challenge in the last few months. So yeah. I feel this tomorrow. What goes up must come down. This is awesome. If you're looking for something different in Florida, I'd recommend this. Just watch out for bikers. I can't say this enough. Not only is it the nice thing to do, it is really prudent when the trail is this um, narrow. All right, where do we go? Right, left? Hmm, let's go this way. Watch your step. Slippery. Awesome. I'm loving this. Loving it. Kind of sad to see there's an oil slick on here. Hmm. All right, let's keep looking. I guess it's the bell to remind people don't bump your head. And I think I found my spot to have a snack. Coming up on this bed of shells and it looks so out of place because this is a trail and not a beach but of course they come out of here out of this lake now the question is who pulls them out are these people fishing we use it as bait or is this perhaps the work of raccoons because there's some more over here Mysteries of the trail. All right, so I'm coming out of the, the trail here and I'm gonna turn onto the service road to get back to where I started and then hopefully get out to Seven Wetlands.
Just a quick note on what else is out in this park. So this is a huge recreational park actually. There's a dog park where I just came out of, playground, soccer fields, um, a ton of soccer fields, baseball fields, more than enough. And then these hiking trails, biking trails, and the connector to the seven wetlands. So um, a lot to do here and something for everyone. And it isn't the wilderness, of course, but it's worth um, exploring. A disc golf course. Very cool. All right, I've made my way back to Seven Wetlands. Kind of went the long way, but um, regardless, I'm here. So the question is red or blue and what I'm looking for is the, bo the boardwalk if you walk to the right and turn immediately left you will have the opportunity for a better viewing okay that's um let's do that uh airplane above me but I haven't seen anyone else out here and there weren't any cars back there other than what was here this morning and I think those are people out on the disc golf course here's some vultures up ahead usually looking for dead animals I don't see one hey big bird shoo shoo So oh, not much to see out here today. Um, perhaps I'm from the boardwalk. A good set of binoculars would help right now. So unfortunately nothing to see from the boardwalk here either. It just makes this half circle. And I would have to head further south um, to connect that loop. I don't know where the other boardwalk is that goes across. From what I understand, there is one that goes across the wetlands. Um, perhaps it's on the blue loop. I don't know. And quite frankly, mileage wise, I don't want to do the entire thing because I think that's close to seven miles. And um, so perhaps that's just all together a project for another day. Now I just have to find the connector of the bike trail, which is right over here. And I'm going to tuck back into the woods. This is much better. Much prefer this over that wide open wetlands area.